He will shut it down again. He will destroy this country. And that's really all you got to say at this stage. I mean, that's all that really matters to the voters right now. Do you want to go through another lockdown? Vote for Biden. This guy will close down the whole country and destroy our country. Our country is coming back incredibly <laughs> well. <laughs> that's, I mean, that's the soundbite of the debate. That should be the soundbite of the, you know, of the rest of the elections. I think that's what's resonating the most with people. You know, up until this stage in the debate, you know, you could say this, you could say that. And then this came out and it was, you know, it's all over for creepy Biden who can't even complete sentences. Gee, this guy will close down the whole country and destroy our country. Our co I have no doubt about that. How many of you have any doubts about that? Do you think Biden will destroy America? I mean, these people are anti-American. They're communists, ladies and gentlemen. He might have a name. But, you know, the good old days, the glory days for, for creepy Biden are gone. He's not there anymore. It's like a meat puppet. It's like a marionette, you know. You have to wonder who's pulling the strings, who's, you know, feeding him the answers. Well, it's the devil, obviously, ladies and gentlemen. That's what these people are into. Let's get into some more of these. Uh, so... Thirdly, clips here. we're poor. The billionaires have gotten much, much more wealthy by a tune of over four, three to four hundred billion dollars more just since COVID. You in the home, you got less. You're in more trouble than you were before. Oh, we're in big trouble with this guy. I mean, you see how he's struggling, you know, with his words. I mean, you look at the micro expressions in his face and it's like, you know, it's really bad. It's really bad. Let's listen to this again here. So, thirdly. We're poor. The billionaires have gotten much, much more wealthy by a tune of over four, three to four hundred billion dollars more just since COVID. You in the home, you got less. You're in more trouble than you were before. It's like being in the retirement home and, you know, you don't want to be mean and stuff, you know, and, and you're just dealing with the situation. But imagine four years of this, right? And it's just like, how much can, you know, a people take? 